everybody, Ryan here from Reverb, and today we're going to be checking out the PRS Sanzera line of amps. And this is the newest amp in the line for 2017. PRS is usually known for their great guitars, which I play many of them myself, but they also make some really killer amps. The amp features one 12 inch Celestion speaker, two 6L6 power tubes, three 12 AX7 preamp tubes, and one ECC83 preamp tube. The tubes are mounted into a steel chassis, so there's no push-pull with the tubes. Also, we have onboard reverb. Uh, the reverb and presence are both global, and we have two channels. We have a clean channel and a distorted channel. And we also have a bright switch. So the SAMP sounds great with both single coils and humbuckers. I'm gonna start first with single coils on the clean channel. <laughs> So this reverb isn't going to have quite the intensity that maybe like a Vibelux reverb or Super Reverb, but you know, it's just going to make the sound really full and it's going to just, you know, be there without clouding the tone too much. <laughs> So now I've switched to a PRS Custom 24, and I'm willing to bet this PRS guitar is going to sound pretty good with this PRS amp. So let's check it out. So let's see how the presence affects the clean channel. Now that's really nice for you know having those fender type sounds but with this amp since you have a master volume separate from the drive you know you can really you know you can have those bluesy tones but at the same time you can go into some pretty otherworldly game territory and get some of those uh, 80s and 90s sounds which you know with a fender amp you'd have probably have to crank the amp up to like eight or nine it'd be extremely loud but with this amp you know you can kind of seamlessly go in between them so let's check out the dirty channel now so it's pretty clear sounding now and to me it almost has like a almost like a Joe Bonamassa sounding sort of tone to it. Let's uh let's crank the mids even further and see what it sounds like then. <laughs> So as you can see, um, just messing around with the mids a little bit, you can get a really nice blues tone from this thing. And I like that it's super clear, and there's a lot, there's a lot of low end response with this amp too, which I really like. So now we got the drive at around 10 o'clock. <laughs> keep going with the drive. So now we're at about, mm, about one o'clock. I have a feeling we're going to start entering some pretty uh, modern territory here on the gain stage. <laughs> sound, you know, it's that Ingve Malmsteen, that rising force <laughs> distortion, you know.
maybe let's scoop out the mids and see what other kind of tones we can get. <laughs> Let's hear the bright switch. Um, currently we have it on and let's see how it sounds with the single coils. And let's hear it with it off. So that was the PRS Sanzera 20 watt amp. Remember there is also a 50 watt amp. I think this is a really great amp. You can get a lot of different tones. For those of you that play PRS guitars, um, I think this is a really good uh, amp to pair with those guitars, as well as you know if you're a Strat player. This amp takes pedals really well. Um, you, know, you could totally probably just get all your gain just staying on the clean channel and using pedals. Um, I think it's a very versatile amp. And I think as we've shown today, you can get a lot of different sounds out of it. So thanks for hanging out with me today. And as with all PRS products, you can find them on Reverb. And we'll see you next time.